What's up guys, this is Billy with Jesse's Performance. Here's Jesse. Hey! Hey, I'm Billy, I'm trying to weld. You gotta, you gotta go real low. So today I'm working on the IROC. I'm going to be modifying the radiator because um, we have this is a single pass radiator but we're going to modify it to be a dual pass so what i'm going to do if you look right here the normal outlets are on each corner of the radiator i'm going to cut this tank in half and add a plate which will force the water to come in come across up and then back through out the top and then i'm going to cut off these an fittings we're going to use just normal um pipe to come off the radiator and use couplers. I'm going to cut the cap off the top and uh, put a plate on the top of this. And then because you can't see it, but we have the radiator actually laid down on these mounts. So it comes across right here. So as the upper radiator hose comes through, I'm going to put a filler cap somewhere right here off of this um, inlet on the water pump it'll be a capless radiator but yeah let's get to it always wear your safety glasses Okay guys, so I got the uh, radiator all welded up. 
And now I'm gonna show you how it actually works. So on a normal radiator, if I were to put air in here, it would come out that side. Well, since I have this block off in here and that's capped over there, it's forcing everything to make basically a U. So it has double the time inside the radiator. There's a dual pass radiator, bud. 